so it's good to see you. This yes. means when you're here, it's time for our Friday. segment, um, The Weekend Wrap with Secret LA. And Secret LA is built as the definitive guide to the most exciting hyper-local happenings across Los Angeles. So Nestor Hernandez is here once again, social media manager of the website. And I don't know how you have time to see and do all the things that you do. <laughs> Me neither, but it's so fun, <laughs> and like I have, like I have no problem planning out your weekend. So okay, it's it's cool for me. Well, you're gonna do it right now because yeah. you're talking Wonderland. What's up yes, with that? Yes, this Alice in Wonderland experience uh, is in LA, and this is really cool because it's a mix of theatrics and uh, ballet. Uh, they have a a Wonderland market as well, which is like local LA vendors that sell really cool magical oh, stuff. Cool. And there's a Mad Hatter tea party you can add on to. A uh, really cool experience. And of course, the Pasadena Civic Ballet is going to perform, um, and it's going to be wonderful. You can get your tickets to the Fever app, of course. And this is the last weekend, so. Oh, how fun! How much are tickets? Do we know? They start like at twenty-five dollars, okay. I think. Uh, it's like a ninety-minute. It's like a really. It's like first you sit down, you have tea, then it's you like see an experience. an experience. Yeah, it's a whole thing. Oh, they also cool. have like a bouncy castle. Like it's like enormous. That's perfect for fans, like huge fans of Alice in Wonderland. That's for sure. Or ballet fans. Or ballet fans, yeah. yeah. Or just food fans. I mean, mm -hmm. take a look at that. Look at all the sweets. <laughs> I love it. Okay, if we're looking for something that's more on the spooky side, you know, yes. it's going to be the first official day of fall later on tonight or tomorrow. Anyway, um, yeah. um, we're really excited about this. Yeah, all my thrill seekers. This is really cool. A ghost tour in iconic Chinatown. Uh, you'll be able to listen to some thrill seeking uh, stories and you'll walk through an eerie cemetery. So listen, this is not for the faint. If you go, <laughs> make sure you take someone with you. They're gonna have some paranormal tools for you to, uh, for you to use so you oh can see gosh. what's happening around you every feet and second of the way. Chinatown has some pretty cool history that not mm -hmm. a lot of people know about and um, the, tour, the guide tour is really knowledgeable. So um, this is a spooky yet historic um, experience for everyone. You know, I actually did this years ago, not in Chinatown, oh, but um, we went ghost hunting with these paranormal activity people from some TV show. This was in nice. when I worked in Bakersfield for a story. Anyway, it was kind of creepy. Yeah, like no, stuff, weird stuff does happen. It so, happens, you yeah. know, just. Just a full warning there. It's definitely <laughs> spooky. Um, we also have on the total opposite end of the spectrum, yes. mindfulness event. Yeah, so for the third, this is the third annual time that the Anaheim Packing District is hosting Mother Nature Market, Mother Earth uh, Market, sorry. And this is a mindfulness and eco-friendly uh, free event that happens. And they're gonna have free yoga, free meditation classes. They're gonna have a clothing swap uh, market and oh, also a vinyl uh, store that you can like go and change your vinyls, um, DJs. So it's gonna be cool. Where is this at? In Anaheim, Anaheim, uh, Anaheim Packaging District. Awesome, that's mm -hmm. a great event, okay. And it's free. I think I just put that on my list. Um, you have a free event too for art lovers and you also have some restaurant food loveliness yes. for people too. Yes, yeah, so this is one of our favorite uh, free art galleries in Los Angeles, mm -hmm. Beyond the Streets, and they are uh, showing three different exhibits uh, one of my favorite, we were just there yesterday, one of my favorite ones is Under the Same Sky. Everything roots within like its graffiti culture. So it's really cool, it's free. Um, it's a lot of art for you to look at. Mm -hmm. So make sure you head out to Beyond the Streets this weekend. It looks for so beautiful. A nice time. I love all the bright colors and also the muted tones too. Mm -hmm. Looks great. Okay, finally we have a food festival and this is on the Paramount Backlot. Right? What? Yeah, Tell for me. all of my foodies. Uh, be prepared for this magical adventure because the LA Times Football is back for its seventh year. Uh, this is really special because it happens in the Paramount back lot, of course. And it's some world-renowned and LA local chefs and food that come together. And <laughs> they dance too. Yeah, there's food, <laughs> cocktails. Listen, who doesn't want to eat their night away? Mm -hmm. I'm all for that. Um, and look, it's at the Paramount back lot. So, so, so cool. So, so cool. fun. Yeah. Oh, I love this. There's so much to do this weekend. I know. Oh, my God. How exciting. Oh, that looks so good. I'm kind of hungry. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for being here. Thank You're the you. best and bringing us all this wonderful fullness throughout Southern California. Yeah. Be on awesome. the lookout for our weekend guide. We have even more. This oh. is just the beginning. We yeah, have like 25 things. The Instagram page is full. <laughs> um, you can find more information about local events. Just go to kcalnews.com slash the morning wrap. We're going to put all of this up on our website too, which is going to be great and our Instagram and all that jazz. But when we come back, we're going to talk about Disney and how much money people are saying they're spending at the theme parks. It's kind of a lot. So stick around. We'll have that conversation coming up.